it's 4 30 ish on friday i'm finally here finally in new york i'm so excited to go to imats i'm so excited to do everything i have a lot planned right now i'm kind of really tired and kind of really starving and it's been a pretty long day i mean traveling you know how it goes it's like epically amazing you're flying through the air cross country at warp speed but you gotta complain a little because it's a hassle right i'm starving I'm tired. Um, I have some nail modifications to do. I'm not wearing very much makeup. I feel like I'm looking a little crusty right now and I probably need to change that. But most importantly, I need to eat something because I'm starving and I'm getting hangry right now. Hangry being hungry plus angry or hungry resulting in angry. I don't know, I didn't make it up, but I like it because it applies to me very frequently. The event for the night is I'm gonna be meeting up with my sister. My sister's gonna be staying with me. Um, she's been in town for, I don't know, like a week or something for work. And um, tonight we are going to a show, I think Hands on a Hard Body, I don't know, I've never heard of it. She texted me, she was like, do you wanna go to a show, da da da. Her friend from work had invited us and she's like, it's called Hands on a Hard Body, but it's not what you think. So I don't know what to expect, I'm sure it's gonna be cool. I love seeing plays, so I'm down for whatever. I don't know what we're gonna eat, I don't know what to wear, I don't know anything right now, but I can show you around the room if you want. I don't know. It's a Weston. You've been in a Weston? It's kind of like that. I was staying in Westons a lot through last fall and so I'm well versed in the Weston world. I'll show you anyway. I will also show you my super awesome travel outfit because I don't know because maybe you want to see. I'm not sure. Epic view time. Oh, oh, New York streets. You so crazy. Not really an epic view. Just, just of you. I want to be where the people are. Anybody else thinking that? I'm thinking that. I'm mostly thinking about food though. Please feed me. Oh, little seating place. Oh, my sister and I are going to share a bed. I didn't know we were going to do that, but apparently we're going to do that. And oh, check it out. I edited a video on the plane and hopefully I'm going to be able to upload it. I'm not really sure, but check out that face. Typical Leanne. Just looking bad. Hi. I don't know why I look so yellowy and weird in here. I think it's like the mix of the lighting. Oh, outfit time. I'm not looking my best. I did not get a lot of sleep last night. <sighs> I'm the world's worst packer. World's worst. It took me until like one in the morning to get that done. And then I had to drive and ugh, I brought so much stuff. I overpack and I'm so indecisive and I don't know. I had to pay extra. So it's an expensive lesson. I've never liked to pack. Like, I don't even know how to force myself to pack. More on that later, probably not. Okay, the outfit. Got my cotton on peace hoodie. Love this thing. At the airport, they even checked the back of the hoodie. Like, what do you think I got in that hoodie? Am I a hoodlum? Maybe. Do I need to be checked in the hood? Probably not. I actually got some double hood action going because I've got my juicy puffer coat on because it's all kinds of cold out there. Um, I love this hood. I love this hood. I love this hood. Don't I just look kind of like a baby animal? Like that's the cuteness that I feel. I probably should never feel like I'm that cute, but I kind of do. I'm not going to lie. I feel like this hood just makes me into a baby animal. I could just get away with murder. I'm not going to try it out though. And then I just have some like Target jeggings on because I decided I had to wear my boots because my boots are really 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 heavy and so I didn't want to wear like tracky pants or like leggings as I thought it would look weird but these are pretty much like leggings I don't know they're kind of comfy they're really old I don't want to talk about it anymore um I got my super fancy argyle socks on they're not that fancy but I like them. And I was wearing these boots. These are my hardcore boots. I just like stomped around. But they're super, super heavy. So I was like, yep, can't go in the suitcase. But look, even though I tried, I barely tried, but I still tried. I still get branded with this business. Heavy, bend your knees, all that. I personally lifted this suitcase more than once into the trunk of a car. Well, into the trunk of a car and then out of a car twice yesterday. 
I have absolutely no strength. I hope I'm not injured. I kind of feel injured now that I saw that. Or I'm just a hypochondriac, I don't know. I kind of have a love-hate relationship with these crazy mirrors that they have in Westons because it's like, whoa, glowing square. And it shows, I like almost don't even wanna film. It shows like every flaw you've like ever even thought about having in your skin. Like you do your makeup and you think it looks all good. And you come and you look in this mirror and you're just like, I'm a mutant. And it's, it's not great. I don't know what it's like. I love it and I hate it at the same time. So much bathroom. Also have a love-hate relationship with those things. Sometimes I take a shower and I don't want to wash my hair. You've got like no choices with this kind of like stick, spout, slash, square, rain on your face shower head. However, I have a love-love relationship with this soap all day, every day. Love it. Okay, so yeah, I'm not that great at doing vlogs, but I'm gonna try 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 obviously i've already done quite a lot right now no promises are being made for now i'm gonna go try to put some makeup on and change clothes get some food change my nails so bye see you later hey okay i have to do this really 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 fast story of my life um didn't change my nails at all i actually did this really cool thing where i just like took a nap accidentally whatever i'm not sure i'm in love with my outfit but that's just what's happening, whatever. It's just like a little sweater from BB. You've seen this leather skirt a bajillion times. It's free people. And then I have my boots that I was wearing earlier. And yes, the socks I was wearing earlier. Don't tell anybody. Um, I don't remember the brand of these boots right now. I'll just tell you later. And tights. And then I'm probably gonna put my uh, puffer coat on again. I don't know, I'm not in love with this outfit. Which makes me mad. Whatever. P.S. Mary's here. Hi. Hi. And she's wearing a really cute outfit too. Hey. What is that, Mod Cloth? Uh, J. Crew. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we gotta go. Bye. I kind of fell down on the job here and I didn't come back and vlog to talk about what Hands on a Hard Body was like. It was kind of amazing and also kind of hilarious that uh, my sister and I, who are both from Texas, went to New York and saw a show that was about Texas. Well, it wasn't really about Texas, but it was based on a documentary that was set in Longview, Texas. And I really, really desperately want to see the documentary now. It's probably gonna be hilarious. I loved the show, it was so awesome. After that, we went to a restaurant, I believe it was called Bluefin. Food was delicious. I don't know, if you have the chance to see this show, go see it, cause I don't know, I really, really liked it. Hey, okay, so it's day two in New York and me and Mary, we just had a brunch at Harry's and it was so delicious. I did not try to do any kind of vlogging or anything before that because I was dying. I was getting so hung hangry, excuse me. I was getting hangry. Mary thinks that word was pretty much made up for me because I get very hangry quite frequently talked about that word yesterday if you missed it, it was hungry plus angry yes um now we are on our way to hopefully do a little bit of shopping i think we're gonna try to check out warby parker i've been really interested in the whole concept or whatever and then just do some oh uh, <laughs> about that um some other shopping or whatever we're having a happy saturday red letter day according to mary and look at her hair, by the way. Totally busted out the princess bun. <laughs> so cute. So cute. She just like walked up and was like, hey. Anyway, that's it for now. I will check in later. Amazing art. Sick. <laughs> I could do this. I don't know where we're going. You're doubting me. I'm doubting everything. We're gonna show up at the corporate headquarters and be like, what's up? We are at Warby Parker. Look at these blue ones. These? Like I like them. Well, you have to compare them to your um, Cabbage Patch Kid ones. <laughs> and then All if right, you fair, think about it like fair, that, it's always good. Fairly. Blue is not practical. These are cute. Those are so Cabbage Patch. <laughs> I'm gonna look at the other side. 
Yeah. Put on the, um, These ones. yeah. Oh, I like that. Are they very clear? Like, can you see it? No. These are thinner. Oh, I like those. I like those on you. Well, my, are those my the same? Thing is, like, I want to see where you like, don't wear makeup and then it, like, hides your <laughs> eyes. It's kind of like my kind of like red, but the same thing. Yeah, I think that they're all the same across the whole row. I like these. Like, you can read the name is on the inside of the yeah. arm. <clears throat> I think the other ones are better. <laughs> Molly from American Girls has traumatized you. Those are not cabbage patch. I like the ones that I'm wearing. They're comfortable. Nedwin. Nedwin? Do I really want to wear glasses that are named Nedwin? Like Edwin with his head. Those are cute. Top shop, my favorite place ever. Not really, but close. This is so cute. It's just like Franny. Oh, Franny. So cute. I'm kind of dying of this. I have to get it. No question. Mary, did you say something? Hi. Hi. Mary's showing me Grand Central Station because I've never been here. And it's so cool. Oh, it's like the star signs. Super touristy. How does this even happen to my hair? Who is this girl? I don't know you. The static is unreal at this point. Okay, so now we are officially on the way to the style hall party and we're all cute and ready and Mary's wearing the cutest outfit ever. I will show you probably when we get there because she'll take off her coat. I love her dress. She's probably gonna be the cutest one there. Who knows? Who knows who's gonna be there? We're excited. We don't know what to expect. Feather bow. This is what it's all about. We went to Topshop and we got some really cute stuff. But anyway, we'll check in later. Bye. This is Mary's really cute outfit. We're at the meetup right now and sorry, had to document. She got the dress at Topshop and I'm obsessed. Oh yeah. All right, and here's a shot of me and Mary at the meetup, and then here are some more pictures that I took with other people that have YouTube channels, and everyone was so nice to me, and I don't know, this was just like my first YouTube kind of meetup event kind of thing where I met other YouTubers and stuff, and it was all just kind of surreal. I don't know if you can really understand what I mean by that, but it was so cool. Everyone was so nice to me, and I don't know why I was shocked by that, but I kind of was. It was amazing. Everybody was so sweet. Unfortunately, I did kind of fall down on the job of vlogging yet again after this event, but I went out to dinner with It's Jill Striff, Nurber XO, and Emily Noel 83 They all have channels on YouTube. That was really, really fun, and everyone was very cool. And then after that, we went and met up with Tracy and Stephanie from 11th Gorgeous and had even more fun, which was, you know, more fun. I wish I had vlogged more during all that, but I don't know. Definitely keep an eye out for my iMats New York vlog part two. It's actually going to show me going to iMats and all that kind of stuff. It may or may not already be up. I will link it down below or somewhere around here so you can find it if it is up. If not, just wait a minute and definitely subscribe. But yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.